Good afternoon guys, it's Daniel from Instrument Choice going over the MISCO Palm AV Digital Refractometer for urine today. Uh, so as you can see, it just comes in a fairly simple packaging. Uh, this is a US made unit, uh, it comes with sapphire optic uh, prism and is also yeah, has a stainless steel well. So as you can see when you open it, this comes packed with the manual itself, a little few tips and tricks about using the meter itself and then the meter and a few little pipettes. You can also get this uh, rubberized case for it to give it a bit more protection. It's a fairly straightforward meter to operate. So essentially go powers the meter on. Then the menu function is used to scroll through uh, the menu functions. So this one's already set up for urine. So basically once it's calibrated using distilled water, you're ready to go. Uh, so to do your calibration, you essentially put a small amount of distilled water straight into the prism and you'd hit go. That would then calibrate the instrument. You could then uh, start with sampling. The other, the other menus aren't too relevant. Um, you can turn your LCD light on or off. Um, I prefer to leave it on uh, just to give you a bit more lighting. You can also change the language if required. Uh, in general, most of us obviously will be using uh, English. Uh, to do a sample, you essentially get a sample of the urine. Uh, obviously a sterile pipette for example is probably best and rinsing it between use. Uh, so you just take a small sample of urine, put it into the sample well, just to cut enough to cover that. Close the light shield to ensure that it's not obstructed or getting changed by those uh, incoming light conditions. And then just hit the go button. Obviously when I push go now, there's no urine on there it'll just give you a no sample detected. If there is a urine sample on there, it'll give you a reading in a specific gravity content. And then you can establish the risk of dehydration, uh, whether it be athletes, workers, or anyone else that you need to do dehydration testing on. So it's a fairly basic meter, very well built, um, being a US product. Um, it's IP65 rated, so it can take splashing and some dust. Uh, so it's good for field use and will last you a number of years. So if you have any questions about this meter, please feel free to give one of us a call on 1300 737 871 or email us at customer-service at instrumentchoice.com.au. Thanks for watching.